Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Marisa. So today we are going to be unboxing the I am so sorry. Two things I'm so sorry about is if you hear the air condition air conditioner in the background. Um it's still not cool enough yet in New York to not have it on. Um and also these shadows because it is like twilight so there are a lot of shadows so i do apologize about that but getting back to it today we are doing the sugar muses the witch's altar to celebrate madon september 2023 we're not going to show the content all right so that is what we are unboxing today so i'm going to roll the intro and we are going to get back to starting opening up this very very exciting box I am back so I think what I'm gonna do is because this box is quite big and this table well lo and behold I got my table I'm trying to find the best angle so I think I'm gonna put this box on the floor and then just take out the items one at a time all right so the because the box is plain um, which is fine because then that means there is more money and more beauty you know going into the box and not the actual box itself all right so um here's a beautiful paperwork and i you know that is the contents of the box so we're not going to show that all right so first two things as usual i mean i don't know where she gets it i don't know if she makes these herself the look at this how beautiful this artwork is I mean, it's fantastic. Look how gorgeous that is. Just beautiful. All right, so there is that. Can that work? Yes, it can work, yay. All right. And here we have a beautiful other art print about Mabon. Um, Mabon is celebrated from September 21st each year and ends September 29th. So basically we're celebrating the autumn equinox and here is some more information you can like screenshot it because i'm not going to read everything but look how beautiful that is really really beautiful and i have heard that mabon is it, well first of all it's a second harvest so the first harvest is um lamas or lunasa um and then the second harvest is Mabon. And then the third, of course, is Samhain, or as commonly known to us, um, is Halloween. And I have heard that Mabon is like kind of like the witch's um, Thanksgiving. It's a, time, it's a time for giving thanks and not just take, take, take. It's thanking the universe or your you know goddesses or god whatever whatever you believe in um for everything you've gotten throughout the year you know everything you've asked for or hoped for or did workings for for yourself it just basically giving thanks and i think that's a beautiful way it's a beautiful it's a beautiful holiday that um you know i'm glad that i added into my own practice all right so let's get started Ooh, so this is the oracle card ah uh, look how gorgeous wow i want i gotta see what deck this is because this is really beautiful this is so perfect because my whole room now is just kind of like is is this vibe right here and then cool down so that's what my card says all right i will read that on my own but it's beautiful deck all right here we go and right off the top here we have some bamboo sorry my camera yet again bamboo incense by herb and herb and earth bamboo incense and it is Bergamot. Bergamot. All right. 
I cannot wait to light that. Oh, very nice. And we got, if I could, you know what, let me use this. We have a beautiful sticker. It looks like some wheat. That's what it looks like to me. Some dried flowers or something like that. All right, so we got a beautiful sticker. These boxes are just so gorgeous. So this is the Sugar Muses box. Um, Sugar Muses puts out this, this is like the deluxe box. And then they also have the um, Midnight Muses smaller box, which is the newest box. And then you have, um, no, 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 I'm sorry, the Midnight Muses. And then you have the Mu Midnight Muses Lux. That's the uh, biggest and newest Midnight Muses box. I am so sorry. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. All right, so there's three boxes. Sugar Muses, Midnight Muses, Lux, and then you have the smaller Midnight Muses. There. This is, wow. Look at this. I mean, she just does such a beautiful job. Obviously, everything is matching. I'm assuming this is going to be a candle. Yep. <sighs> it smells lovely. Absolutely beautiful. We will light that at the end, but that is gorgeous. I mean, wow. This is beautiful. All right. Let me shut my mouth because I'm never going to stop talking. All right. What is this? So here's another matching tin. So maybe this is just empty. Oh, no. I don't know why I thought it was going to be empty, but... Whoops. Some, maybe some dried flowers in there. Um, to me, this is probably maybe a little soap or uh, maybe a, like a dried lotion. You know, like those lotion bars. So it's just some packaging. And that is absolutely lovely. So I would probably use this tin as maybe as a Mabon, um, like an altar bowl, like an offering bowl. Or you could put your jewelry in here. I mean, you know, whatever. All right, so far I am as, I mean, I'm never disappointed. All right, next up, I am excited because I'm running out of sprays. What is this? An altar spray fall. And all her labeling. I just love her labels because every month, every box has matching labels. I mean, she just puts such detail into her boxes. And I'm sorry, I'm just like in awe. So this is the fall Equinox altar spray. So I, a lot of times, use these sprays all over my body. Like, I'll just spray it in the air over my head um, to kind of clear my energy. And I will, you know, spray it on my altar as well. So I'm going to spray this and see. All right. Ooh. Oh. It smells just like fall. I mean, it has all like the allspice and the cinnamon and the apple. It just, it smells all that. I'll read the paperwork real quick um, off camera because I know that could be a little long-winded, you know, when I read everything, but the things that I'm just curious about. Oh, wow, this is lovely. This beautiful, um, wood burned altar tile i don't know if that's a hole no it's not a hole i thought maybe it's for incense but wow absolutely gorgeous very 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 beautiful very pretty i am so excited no i don't know if you can see that that's all right all right and i mean this box is jam-packed of stuff so, oh, here's another sticker. All right. And what do we have here? 
Ooh, we have a stovetop simmer. So a lot of people, and you can do this any time of the year, um, to do uh, simmer pots, okay? Uh, you could put in, or you could put in dried flowers and cinnamon and apples and lemons. I mean, you could do this any time of year with different ingredients. Um, and I cannot see what it says because the print is so, there it is. There we go. So that is that. And that's what it looks like. All right, I'm going to open it real quick. Obviously, this video is going to be a little bit longer than the last one. And thanks for everyone who watched my video. I really appreciate it. Oh, lovely. Yeah, that's what it looks like inside. Really nice. All right. This is exciting. I'm so I love this time of year. It's my favorite time of year. I know so many people say that, but truly, fall and winter is definitely... Uh, my favorite time of the year really I like the colder weather and if you watch my channel all um, over the past you know couple of years or whatever you will know this so we have a little sachet here and it's black with some gold um, moon and stars and you have a black and white candle and here let's see if I can open this without taking too much time. You know what, I'll be right back and I'm gonna open, um, All right, open this I up. am back. I just kinda opened up any little bags and stuff. So, we have two candles, one black, one white. Obviously the fall equinox is like equal, right? Equal light, equal dark. So, it's kind of, it's basically a balance between the two this time of the year. And then we have these little guys in there as well. Alrighty. So we got the candles. We can, I'm assuming we're gonna be doing a little spell. That's wonderful. Alright, next up we have another sachet in here. Ooh, wow. Beautiful tiger's eye. Uh, oh, how, okay. So, I don't know, that looks like maybe the symbol for water, air, yep, okay. Um... I don't know what symbol that is, but I'm just gonna, I, I don't wanna assume anything, but this is obvious that that is fire. To me, this look, looks like water, or maybe wind, mm, I don't know. All right, this could be air, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm feeling like this is more water, honestly. Um, and then here, I'm assuming this is Earth. This is really gorgeous. Like this whole, like kind of tiger's eye feel. Beautiful, beautiful colors. Um, and it comes in this beautiful brown sachet, which I have so many of these, but these are great for spell bags. So don't throw these out. I mean, you can re-gift them, use them for little gifts and stuff as well. So that is absolutely gorgeous. I don't know if you guys can see that there we go I'm just experimenting a little bit with um, my kind of my new setup in my room now because it's all different right okay we got two more items and then I'm gonna look at the paperwork real quick and just look at a couple of things and see what's in the spray um, and what's in like what kind of candle this is and stuff like that so here, ooh, a huge bag of Mabon Circle Salt. So this is for your ritual salts. You can make a circle if you like to do that. I don't do, I don't um, create circles. A lot of times I'll do energetic circles. Um, 
but yeah, I, I actually for the first time did a salt circle in this room and it was really lovely because I had my own piece of quiet. It was just wonderful. So I'm gonna open this up as well, real quick. All right, and of course, as usual, I'm gonna put um, the link to this company's box. Not a, It's not an affiliate link or anything like that. Just a link to the box. Um, if you wanna check out her company, I believe her name is Christy. And just, I mean, absolutely amazing. I thought I was gonna get an oil, but I'm actually really, really, I think maybe she either does like a, um, a sprayer in oil. I have so many of her oils, and quite frankly, her oil is magnificent. So, it's just, you know, everything is scented so nice and perfect, and I just smell really lovely. This is not as strong, uh, the salt, but it does have like a slight scent. To me, Actually, I don't want to... Okay. See, I'm trying to figure this out. All right. Anyway. Um, but so far, this is absolutely gorgeous. And the last item, that's what it seems like. Yeah. That is the last item. Is now. This is magnificent as well. This is absolutely gorgeous altar bell look at this is that not beautiful and it has the triple moon on both sides now the little i don't know what this is called but like the thing to make it ring was disconnected from it i guess i have to do it myself um yeah and i don't know how to do that it has like a little hooky thing on it um but i'm gonna figure that out off camera otherwise if i do it on camera um well you just may be sitting here for an hour while i figure that out so we're not gonna have that but i mean it's not gonna it's not doing it justice all right the sound of the bell but i'm gonna figure that but this is let me really really beautiful so that is the biggest item in the box but just gorgeous I'm very, very, as usual, um, impressed here. I'm just gonna pan out so you see everything here. And again, I'm sorry about any shadows. So I am going to look at the paperwork really quick and just find out um, a couple of things that I'm just interested in. And I will All right. right, so. I'm just going to show you some information since we already know what's in the, um, just information, kind of like what I said about the time of year it is. All right. And then this page is a spell, but I'm not going to show that. But in the spray, I was kind of right with most of what it smelled like. Um, where is it now? Okay. Shake well, spray in a circular motion. Um, well, what did I? I just saw it. I am sorry. Oh, yeah, okay. Charge moon water, cinnamon, clove, essential oils, natural apple, and vanilla extract. So that's what's in here. Um, and of course, you have the bergamot um, incense and then the Madon candle over here um it's similar uh scent as well if i could go back to it yes yeah, scented with clove spices pomegranate apple and vanilla and it's organic and vegan so that is absolutely gorgeous i absolutely love this um as usual i am never disappointed with any of those of her Boxes. Oh, and yes, I was I was just curious about this. This is a soap. It's not like um, one of those lotion bars. It's soap. And it's a sunflower-shaped soap. And what does it say? Can I read it? Yes. No. <laughs> I. Oh, here it is. Scented with lemongrass, calendula, and sunflower. Cool. 
absolutely beautiful. I mean, I don't know what else to say, except I think everything is wonderful. It smells wonderful. I am very happy as usual. So yeah, guys, that is it for today. I just want to show you here how beautiful everything looks. And this will make a beautiful, uh, add to my beautiful Mabon altar that I already started kind of putting together. I changed my, um, I just changed up my altar. I love doing that each season. It just helps me kind of celebrate the season, celebrate the holidays, really get involved with it, with the smells and the scents and lighting and the candles. And it's just lovely. So that is it today guys let me know in the comments below what your favorite item was <clears throat> I'm gonna be honest the art print is magnificent um, I love the spray it smells so good I mean it's kind of hard for me but I do love those elemental uh, tiger's eye <clears throat> sorry and yeah, I mean, I don't know. It's really hard for me, but I love the art print and I, I mean, she's beautiful. So that is it guys. Thank you so much for watching today and thank you for coming back after I've been away for two months. I really, really appreciate it. And I wish everyone a beautiful autumn equinox, you know, happy autumn, whether you sub our Mabon or not. You know, enjoy this weather. The leaves are going to start to change. Really enjoy it. I am so much looking forward to it. And I will see you in the next one, guys. Bye.